Hey everybody, welcome to Mom Plays. I am Mom and we are continuing to play Fallout New Vegas. Let's make sure we have all of our stuff equipped. Um, I'm also gonna do that. Um, so apparel wise, we have our combat helmet and our combat armor on. And weapon wise, Where is... Yes, my assault rifle. Did I just see... Okay. Alright, so we are now going to head... Oh, let's see. Uh, so birds of a feather is what we need to be doing, which is deliver the package to a man at the designated location, which is... Oh my gosh, really? Which is, we'll go Durable Dunn's outside here. So let's go to Durable Dunn's Sacked Caravan, which was part of Cassidy's stuff. Hopefully the frickin' Legionnaires will not attack me this time. That would be great. He should be just over, over here, kind of up against these hills. know what that red blip is and I do not want to know what that red blip is that red blip needs to leave us alone ah here he is oh excuse me all right so who we got here hello are you the Van Graaff's emissary maybe uh sure do you have what we requested uh yep huh then our business is concluded. Tell your superiors that we will contact them shortly. Hmm. He definitely talks like somebody who might be part of the Legion. But we will dutifully go tell the Van Graffs because we are undercover right now. We are undercover squirrels. All right, let's go tell them what they need to know. I love this. There's all sorts of running around we have to do. Just to you know, get ourselves infiltrated into the Van Graffs so that we can, well, ultimately kill them. We just exploded those guys everywhere, didn't we? You got anything good on you? No. Of course they don't. Now you notice he didn't tell me he had to take my weapons anymore? And that is why you help the Van Graffs, because then you will be able to bring all your weapons in here, and they act like you're trustworthy, so that's always nice. Welcome back. Did you have news for me, or are you just here for the guns? Well, I delivered the package as requested. And? Don't leave me in suspense. What was their reaction? Uh, he said you'd hear from them soon. Uh, they seem pleased, and they said they'd be in touch. I like that better. Good. Good. Here's your payment. If you'll excuse me, I have some thinking to do. Oh. Sean baptiste was talking about a matter earlier that he needs help with. I volunteered you. See him for the details. All right. 
right, so now what does he need us for? Where is he? Hey. Hey. There he is. Ah, just the person I was looking for. Your name came up in a discussion we had recently. My sister is very impressed with you so far, but I'm not. I don't think you have what it takes to work for this family. You don't know anything. Luckily for you, I'm going to give you a chance to prove me wrong. What do you say? Want to make some real money? Sure. All right, then. If we're going to work together, there's only one thing you need to know about me. I like things simple. Recently, Glory negotiated a deal between us and a big-time player. We're talking more caps than you'd probably see in a lifetime. Your part in this is simple. To finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. All right, well, who is this girl? Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's some fancy shit, right? Don't know what her mother was thinking with a name like that. No but fancier than Jean-Baptiste. discussion. Find her. Bring her here so I can talk to her one-on-one. -on -one. Mm-hmm. If I run across her, I'll let her know. Find her. Bring her back here so we can talk. Needless to say, there's some good money in it for you. Yep, I'm sure there is. Uh, but at the same time, you are not. That's not happening. All right, so we need to pick this lock. Oh, come on. Don't be that way. I need to pick it. Thank you. And you gotta be hidden to do that, so... Let's close the door behind us. We also need to get into this safe. Thank you. And we need this letter to Gloria. There's all sorts of stuff in there. Which you notice we did not get bad karma for. Investigate the CEO. So we've got evidence of the Van Graaff's guilt for Cassidy. Nope. Haven't been in here at all. You guys didn't see a thing. Thank God our sneak is high enough. Okay. So... This is what I mean by intersecting things. So Jean-Baptiste wants Cassidy. And she's our companion, our follower. And we're not going to give her away. Um, so, uh, yeah, that's, that's a thing. We're not going to give her away. We need to go to the Crimson Caravan. Because the other thing we need is uh, proof that... Uh, who is it? Alice McLafferty there at the Crimson Caravan also screwed over Cassidy. So we need we need evidence from both of them. And the only way you can get this evidence is by stealing these things. So we're kind of stuck stealing things. But anyway, so Jean-Baptiste wants Cassidy. They're calling it a loose end. Like, I don't know what they think. She sold them. She sold the Crimson Caravan company her her, you know, business. I don't know why they think they need to kill her, too. But hey. that's what Jean-Baptiste wants, is to kill her. So, uh, yeah. Let's just talk to Alice really quick. All right, bye. It's been a pleasure. She doesn't have anything I want to know. Um, and we need to get her thing out of here. And, of course, we're detected. Oh, we're hidden now? Let's go in. Let's get it. Usually I wait till nighttime before I do any of this, but whatever. Crimson Caravan Van Graaff Agreement. And we're going to take it. So what have we got here? We have, come on. 
This is an agreement between the Crimson Caravan Company and the Van Graffs to undercut or eliminate all other rival caravan companies in the region, such as the Gunrunners and Cassidy Caravans. In the case of Cassidy Caravans, Gloria Van Graff has agreed to use mercenaries against Cassidy Caravans to drive down the company's value, allowing McLafferty to purchase the remaining assets at a bargain price. Lovely. In the letter to Gloria says, Dear Ms. Van Graff, it has come to my attention that Cassidy Caravans have suffered... A number of setbacks recently. I can only hope that these latest unfortunate events drive that young booze hound of an owner to finally sell me her remaining assets. As per our agreement, I have bent my not inconsiderable efforts towards weakening your competitors, the gun runners. You can expect a mysterious and sudden surge in sales in the near future. Sincerely, Alice McLafferty. All right, so we've got we've got some stuff for uh for Cassidy here. So let's go. Let's go talk to her. And then what we'll be able to do is we'll be able to talk to her and there's different ways you can convince her. You can convince her to ki that Alice needs to die, you know, she, all that stuff. Everybody needs to die. <coughs> Or you can convince her, I think it's that the NCR prosecute them. She's not very happy with that one, but it saves bloodshed. Um, not so sure I'm too worried about that bloodshed thing because obviously these two are evil. But let's go talk to Cassidy and see what she says about all this. And of course we told her to stay behind in the Lucky 38, so... go to our suite and uh, let's see oh look at that there's Cass well now look what rolled in what you getting lonely out there maybe um ask him then Why would I say Huh Um Wow, that's weird. Okay, so let's say John Baptiste and Freeside wanted to meet with you. Jean Baptiste. Sounds like someone got knocked out of the good book so hard his name broke. Either that, or it's Canadarian or some such shit. So who is this Baptiste, and what does he want? Uh, he's with the Van Graffs. The only Van Graffs I know are the ones out west. Well, except for Gloria Van Graff, and I don't know her all that well. Nor do I want to. It's true. Don't have any objections speaking with him. Though if he's with the Van Graffs, he should know I'm not looking to buy weapons. All right, let's move on. All right, then. So, uh, Cass, come back well, here. now, look what rolled... I know. Uh, I think we should travel together. Can't be any worse than here. This is true, because this is not a bad place. Now I need to talk to you. You find any evidence yet? I'm not going to wait forever. All right, here's both pieces of evidence. No shit. There it is. The blood, the motive, as clear as day. They must have penned these with snake venom. Possibly. But we got it. Now what? Sure, this damns them, but only if someone listens. Uh, anyone you trust in NCR? Well, Jackson and the Mojave Outpost could get it to the folks in the West. I wouldn't trust anyone closer to the Colorado. And the Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs have their heart back West. Not sure it'll do any good, though. <laughs> After all the shit I went through to get this, we're going to Jackson. All right, let's do it. Listen to what he has to say. Okay, perfect. Let's do it. 
let's do it. And we are finally going to finish up one of our companion's quests, which is nice. I, Some of them are long and involved, and you have to wait a long time for them to, like, start telling you the things you need to know to get their quests going, which is kind of annoying in one way and kind of not in another. Um, but uh, Cass's is actually one of the easiest ones. Which quest am I on? Let's go back to this one and go all the way back up here to the Mojave outpost where we first met Cass and talk to our friend Jackson. Michael Jackson. No, not Michael Jackson. Janet Jackson? Possibly Janet Jackson. Let's go see what's up with Janet Jackson. Tito? Tito Jackson? Maybe. Okay. Uh, that's Major Knight. Jackson is usually hanging... Oh! Right there. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you. But nothing else on the radar at the moment. That's fine. Um, I have evidence of a, caraba a caravan. Caravan conspiracy? What is it? Let me see. All right. This is... This explains a lot of the lost caravans. I thought it was Legion work, but... Can you get it to the right people, Mr. Mustache? I can, if you make me a promise. No. I need you to swear you won't take revenge on Gloria or Alice. If you do, then your case is over, and we can't see that justice is done. I know some things are hard to let go, but you and Miss Cassidy need to understand that. Hear me? Um, sure, no problem. Mm. All right. You change your mind and start shooting, then I can't help you. Show up here after, I'll put you in chains. Get on now. I'll make sure this gets west, and let the wheels of law start turning in the courts. God, what a mess. People turning against each other when the Mojave's at risk of falling. If the Republic's sinkhole progress doesn't kill us, greed will. Thanks for bringing me this. I know revenge must have been tempting. Oh, it is. For what it's worth, I appreciate you didn't shed any more blood. We need to save our strength for the Legion. Okay, Tito. You're welcome. I'll do what I can. And those folks that got killed need to be answered for. Well, that's settled. I suppose. Are you all right? Feels... I don't know. I guess I feel relieved. I don't know what I feel. Wait, that's not true. I think the NCR back west, when riled, is gonna be the worst enemy the Van Graffs and the Crimson Caravan ever had. They're all so mired in procedure and paper out there. The kind of evidence we gave is going to be worse than shooting them. I think that settles accounts with me. And my men. That was some tricky political maneuvering, but worth it, even if it takes a few years. So Cass has gained the Calm Heart perk, giving her a permanent health bonus, and so that's a perk for her. And that is beautiful. Let's move on. All right, then. Great. Let's go, Cass. We have got some revenge to, hap to, 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 to do, regardless of what we said to Mr. Jackson. So I don't think I've ever been back to the Mojave Outpost after uh, I've turned this quest in, because literally this should be the last thing to do here. There's nothing else to do here. And um, that, let's do this um and so i honestly don't know if he actually does have you arrested <laughs> um or killed or whatever after this because basically you did that you go to do the port we're gonna do now and you'll see what happens and it's not really our fault so i don't think he actually there's any repercussions for this but either way
let's just kind of close. Whoa! Hello! Okay, we're being attacked and we didn't even know it. Wait a minute. Was that the crier here? <gasps> it was. She just killed him right away. I didn't know she would do that. I don't think I knew she would do that. Let's paint this place red. Oh my. Well, I mean, we're going to fight whether we want to or not. Sorry, Simon. I thought maybe we could talk about this, but that ain't gonna happen. Oh shit. We want we want something a little bit different, I think. Oops. Um where is my grenade rifle? Nice. That was nice. Look at that. Alright, Simon, let's see. We're going to search you for your combat armor. Oh yeah. We are also going to get dangerous on our carry weight here. Um, so this is the combat armor we're wearing. Shoit. I know, I'm over encumbered. Can't fix that one. Shoot. We're not going to be able to take it all because I don't think we're going to be able to carry it all. Hold on just a minute. Let's just... Uh, let's just see how much we can fix. And we might be able to give some to cast too. We have one extra thing of combat armor. So we're going to turn around to Cass. Careful where you flash that ship of yours. Not sure what... Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, Ask him then. I don't think I have questions. Never mind. Sounds um, good to I me. Need to, I need to have you take something off of me. Let's see. Stimpak, wait here. Be aggressive. Open inventory. Let's see what you got. You have an empty whiskey bottle. That's interesting. Um, all right. So please take that. Yes. That's fine. She doesn't have to whip. Oh, so she won't even carry it? Let's see what you got. All right. Um... Can you carry that for me then? Whoa, she's wearing it. All right, you can wear it. Uh, the other thing we're gonna do is save because I don't wanna, I don't wanna have to do that part all over again. And then, in we go. Oh, no, you don't. Yes! And there goes Gloria. Gloria! Shit. Come on, Jean Baptiste. Really? Oops, that was further away than I wanted it to. Oh, thanks, Cass. Thank you. If you say you're going to gather evidence, then you <laughs> kill the bitches anyway, at least tell me when you change your mind. Now, if you're done fucking around, let's settle accounts the old-fashioned way. Don't matter much how we settle this, as long as it gets settled. Just trim the Van Graaff family tree. I think Freeside will breathe a little easier now. I think they will too. Now, on to settle accounts with Alice McLafferty. Putting her down, that would suit me just fine. 
Yeah. Can't wait to see the look on her face when I show up. Except we're not show going to. Music to my ears. We're not going to because we don't need to. We're going to just come in here. Merc Charmer, huh? Um, and the only reason we were doing this is because this guy here wanted you dead. So, I mean... Alright, so now we can return to Elder Harden. We are going to steal all the energy cells that we possibly can. I, I did not want that. No. No. I want... Ah, sons of bitches. Those are drained, so I don't care about those. Fine, whatever. Pulse grenade. Um... Ooh, plasma grenade. Um, we're gonna end up giving Cass a bunch of stuff, and that's okay. Hmm, plasma cutter, eh? I don't think we have one of those. And I am over encumbered. What do you got here? Laser RCR? Hey, come here, Cass. Let's distribute the weight. Yeah, let's do. Um, I would like you to take plasma caster. Thanks. And maybe the ripper. Maybe that. Okay, thanks. Um, I don't need mines. Anything else get thrown all over the place? Let's see. The thug has some good bottle caps. Fix the combat armor. Ugh. Perfect. Okay, so there's that. I don't know why we're still hidden. Let's just get out of sneak here and come steal all this stuff. This is the one thing that I do like about this is being able to steal all this stuff from them. All right, let's see if there's anything else we want to steal, which I happen to know that there is. There's more stuff in here. So let's uh, open the safe back up, take their anti-venom. Oh. And now we're not stealing. Let's look at their terminal also while we're here. That was a good guess again. Doing good. All right, what do we got going on in here? Oh, just the lock. No notes or anything. Boring. So if you are into energy weapons, this is a great place to hit. Because they have a ton of stuff. And after you kill them, apparently your karma is fine. Pulse grenades. Pulse grenades. Nice. Beautiful. Cass, we're almost done. We're just gonna look. You know what? Aww. I can't sleep on an owned bed. And of course, all these are owned even though everybody is dead. Oh, that sucks. Pre war relaxed wear. Pretty sure I'm good without that. Can't even get into those cases. I love how it's making the death toll 
noise here. Because, yes, the death toll has happened. Oh, you know what we could do? Um, we could... Doctor's bag. And stim pack. There we go. Now I'm not walking with a limp. All right, I think we have gotten everything that we need to get out of here. Uh, let me just make sure the bathrooms don't have first aid kits. Oh, but they do. Beautiful. All right, I think we are done here. And that ends it, I think, for this episode. Um, let's just make sure. Yep. All right, so it's just tend to your business. And, uh, well, Cass, um, yeah, I think we're done here. Heads have been rolling. That's a good thing. Ooh, what do you got? Forgot this guy. Can we fix this last piece of armor? Let's find out. Let's find out. Look at that. Now we have plenty of fixed combat armor to uh, get us through the rest of this. All right, so what I'm going to do is I am going to... Um, Dump Cass back off at the uh, Lucky 38. Take her combat armor back from her. Um, and Because I like them to be dressed in their original outfits. Because it's them. You know what I mean? Um, I'm going to do some off-the-record housekeeping. Or, you know, uh, off-camera housekeeping. Selling and all that good stuff so that we're not over-encumbered. And in the next episode, we will go back to the Brotherhood and tell them the Vagrafts have been dealt with, and hopefully get our power armor training. That would be great. In the meantime, you have been watching Mom Plays. Um, you can follow me on Twitter at Tonya Trees, and I will catch you all next time.